and carry out the necessary performance, durability and safety tests. The battery pack contains lithium ion cells packed into modules. Every module is also fitted with cooling lines Inclusion of liquid cooling within the battery for a hot weather country like India is super important. Batteries lose their efficiency in extreme temperatures. Ambient temperatures during summers can go beyond 50 degrees in states like Rajasthan. Batteries also generate heat while charging or discharging. So they need to be kept cool at a temperature where they work most efficiently. And if the performance of the car has to be maintained even under those conditions, the battery liquid cooling enables us to meet the performance as well as the life durability expectations. The project Mango Survey had revealed customer anxiety about driving an electric vehicle on wet Indian roads. And it was very important for us to allay people's fears of an electrical system being inside water or in contact with water. People had fears about whether it would mean some uh, electric current passage to them and harming them. The solution was to seal the battery against water, humidity and dust and get it an IP67 rating. This rating certifies that the battery can be immersed in water up to one meter deep for half an hour without water getting into the battery. Tata Motors is so confident about the battery it offers 8 years warranty on the battery pack. Water and temperature are not the only stress for a battery. At the design stage, battery prototypes were subjected to an array of tests. These are the tests which actually test the uh, battery pack under entire adverse conditions of typical Indian uh, road conditions, the potholes, the bumps. In fact, the off-road conditions which a vehicle undergoes. In all, 45 tests were conducted on the batteries during the development stage. A lift raises the battery to the vehicle floor. Workers now attach low voltage, high voltage and earthing wires to the battery. Coolant connections are made. And finally, a fuse is attached to the battery pack. The battery is now powered up and the car is tested for road worthiness. A wheel alignment test to ensure a smoother ride. roll and brake to check brake performance. A shower test where the EV is sprayed with water at 1.8 bars of pressure for 9 minutes. This is to ensure there is no water leakage inside the cabin. Finally, the quality assurance team ensures every tiny detail of the car is up to the mark. A total of 12 tests are carried out on every Nexon EV that rolls off the factory. Today, 70 Nexon EVs roll off the line like clockwork. The facility has a capacity to produce 10,000 EVs per year.